yeah hi this is Dinesh Kumar in this video we are going to discuss about how can I send files or how can I send messages in online or in offline means online means how can I chat with my friend on Unix network how can I send files in Unix network in offline mode so for these we have to use communication commands there are two communications one is online communication and one is offline communication what is online communication the both sender the who will send the messages and the receiving person who is receiving the messages so both persons should be in login position what is offline communication only sender is in online and the receiver may or may not in online that is called as offline communication right so these two things can be performed by using two different commands one is write command to communicate with a person in online mail command we have to initiate to communicate with a person in offline mode so what is the syntax of write command yeah write command is to send online messages so here both sender and receiver should be in online it means both should be in login position yeah right so and so username you have to submit the username okay and if optionally you can specify terminal number also on so and so terminal number he is working okay and press enter whenever you are hitting enter key immediately the request will be sent to unix server the unix server or linux server will check the user is in currently login position or not if he is in login position the cursor waits here if he is not in login position it will the server will display a message to the sender so what kind of message it will display right now the receiver or so and so user is not in login position okay <clears throat> So let us assume the user is in login position. So here, suppose if you type hi and hit enter, immediately this word will be sent to corresponding user. So if he want to send any messages to me, then he has to initiate write command. He has to initiate write command in his system. Right? Yeah. So write to so and so user so here i am using the username pv and enter so he is uh, hi like good morning right so whenever he is hitting immediately the message will be sent to this person here pv is initiating this command here some other user let us say dinesh is initiating this command in his system two systems this is the system one and this is system two so both are right now in currently logged in position so that initiation of write command is possible for these two users okay once their communication is finished then how a user can terminate write command at the end of the communication he has to press control d and he wants to terminate he has to press control d individually then they are terminating in the communication terminating the communication right this is called as online communication okay next suppose pv is trying to initiate a right command to dinesh okay in this system dinesh is working let us assume he is working under this system he is very busy let us assume he is busy with some other work he don't want to receive any messages he don't want to receive any messages while he is working so then immediately Dinesh has to initiate this command M E S G N okay press enter means i don't want to receive any messages this request will be sent to unix server 
so unix server should not allow any other person to send any messages to dinesh okay so yeah already he has initiated this right now pv is trying to write a message to dinesh right dinesh and he tender immediately pv will receive a message so dinesh is not ready to receive any messages dinesh is not ready to receive any messages to receive any messages this message will be displayed on pv system then pv can understand okay he is busy so he stopped to communicate with dinesh so this kind of messages will be displayed to any person who is trying to send a message to dinesh so it so if dinesh wants to receive the messages after his work is over he has to initiate this command m e s c y okay means yes i am ready to receive messages in that case you can send any messages to me directly that messages will be displayed on my system right this is what about online communication now let me discuss about offline communication <coughs> offline communication offline communication is performed by using the command mail what is offline communication offline communication so what is offline communication yeah sender should be in logged in position sender is already logged in position here receiver may or may not log in may not log in but in any case he is in login position still the message will be sent to him and he is in not logged in position still the messages will be displayed if he is not logged in the messages resides under server the messages resides under unix server until he logged in unix server how do i send offline messages offline files let us see the offline communication is performed by using mail so mail to so and so person specify the username okay and hit enter type your data and press control d so if he is in logged in position the message will be sent to him if he is not logged in then the message will be sent to server so it's a server it's a server if he is in offline okay so once the person is in online from server the message will be sent to that person if he is in logged in this is known as mail command okay so whenever i am not in logged in position means i am in offline position uh, right now i am not currently logged in i have received so many mails so many persons send me some mails how can i see the mail mails received by me how to see mails received by me see mail and press enter mail and then press enter here one so so and so mail received from so and so person two so and so mail received from so and so person three so like this it will display all the list of mails received by me now how can i see or how can i open one mail completely i want to read out the complete full details of a mail how do i read out see after this list at the end of the list you have ampersand symbol in the ampersand symbol if you want to see the full message details of first mail press enter type one and press enter it will display the complete details of first message at the end of this message again it shows ampersand symbol yeah i want to remove this message d d for 
delete so whatever the message just now it opened that will be deleted okay now i don't want to delete the current message i want to delete the third message then specify the number of that mail and apply the command d then third mail will be deleted from your inbox third mail will be deleted from your inbox okay come to here at the ampersand symbol if you want to save second mail yes i want to save second mail to s and specify the file name then your mail details will be saved under this file second mail details will be saved under this file okay that finished next if you want to cave out from mail then just apply q and press enter automatically it will display dollar symbol let us assume you have 10 mails you have worked with three mails that was finished what about the rest of the mails from fourth mail to 10th mail what is happening to these mails actually i have received these mails but i didn't check the mail details so whatever the unread mails are there that unread mails actually uh, according to our ac uh, mail accounts the mails are waiting under inbox in the same way the unread mails will be saved under means 4 to 10 unread mails will be saved under m box folder <coughs> unread mails are saved under m box folder you can open that folder at any moment and you can check out the unread mails that's all about communication commands thank you